There are so many things I wish I had the time for, simple tasks or goals. But just writing them down on my to-do list, the work didn't seem to get done though. So I needed to come up with something bigger than that. And this is where I created my simple but really effective ultimate morning plan that I'm going to share with you today. My name is Stephanie Lauer and I'm really, really happy to share with you what helped me over the past month get really excited about my mornings, be more motivated and also more productive. Have fun! Tip number one is set yourself up for success the night before. I like laying my clothes up the night prior so that in the morning I do not have to take care of do I have clothes enough, do I look good in this, no. I lay out what I'm going to wear and this is exactly what I'm going for in the morning. I do not spend any time just thinking about it or even doubting on myself, no. This is what I'm going to wear, this is my outfit and I'm ready for it. Also, I like preparing my breakfast um, or if there's anything I can prepare for my breakfast, um, I just set the table, I get everything done so that I do not have to take care of that in the morning. I also make sure that my desk is really nice and clean. I tidy everything up the night prior so in the morning I will be able to have a really productive time in a really creative space of work. Nothing will be laying around that doesn't belong to my creative area. After laying my clothes out, having my breakfast ready and my desk ready for me to be productive and creative, I like writing a short list of three things that I want to accomplish the next day. Yes, only three things because those three are the most important to me and after I have those ready I can focus on everything else like emails and other things that also need to get done. Then comes tip number two which is prepare your body. After having a good night's sleep I like taking a shower, I like dressing like a boss and then having some breakfast because yes no matter if you're going to work from home or if you're going elsewhere if you feel like a boss, you work like a boss. So dress like one and the feeling will come from its own. Tip number three is prepare your mind. I like dedicating about 10 minutes of my time in the morning to just having a good read or listening to an inspirational, motivational video or podcast. Um, what also helps for me is taking a good look at my goals. Um, Looking at the bigger picture, no matter if you're taking small steps each day, will make a huge difference and motivate you a lot. So this is something I love doing before taking on any of the tasks. Tip number four is catch your productivity flight. I call it a productivity flight because it's the time where I will set a timer for 90 minutes where I'm going to have my phone on flight mode and just concentrate on the tasks I have in front of me. In this time, nothing else matters. I'm not gonna listen to any music, I'm not gonna tidy around the house, I'm not gonna do anything else but accomplishing those tasks. After that, I make sure to get a 30 minute break where I'm going to listen to some music, stretch a bit, let some fresh air in the room, do social media, whatever I have to do, and then make sure to catch my flight for the next 90 minutes again. Last but not least comes tip number five, and that is know when your work is over and celebrate your success. After getting the work done, I love taking a look at what I have accomplished and how that helped me come closer to the goal I'm working towards. So whatever it is that I did, I love reflecting on what worked out really well or what should I accomplish maybe the next time. Um, just thinking about next tasks already or whatever it is that will help um, better my work or um, I don't know make it more easy the next time okay this is it I hope you like my little plan on how to have a productive morning I hope it helps you out a lot I also did a little planner which you can download somewhere over here um, just for you to fill out the blanks um, fill out the tasks that you want to do and also have an overview on the steps I just talked about um, if you like this video and would like to see more of that, please subscribe and give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel and I would love to keep in touch. Also, if you have any other tips, let me know in the comments um, because I'm really open for improvement and I really want to get towards my goals. Um, this is something we're in together and I would love to get to know more about you. Have a good one and see you the next time. Bye!